Hello, hope you guys had a great weekend. I was in the upstate last weekend and stopped by the design center called Manitoga, built by American industrial designer Russell Wright. Enjoy. Russell Wright is known as an innovative designer with his signature utensils and dining wares made of ceramics. So he enlightened many Americans in using practical utensils during the middle of the 20th century. Let me briefly explain Manitoga. The land of Manitoga was purchased by Russell Wright in 1942. After his wife passed away early, he started to build his studio and residence in this area. Manitoga was finally constructed in 1961, and Russell spent most of time here until his death. As Manitoga is located in the middle of the forest, we need to walk along the hiking track for a few minutes. Look how beautiful nature is here. At some points, Manitoga reminds me of the concept of Frank Lloyd Wright organic architecture. As Frank Lloyd Wright considered the harmony between nature and architecture, Manitoga was also built based on the same concept. The physical space of Manitoga was almost camouflaged to nature as a part of it, so we cannot really see the contours of the architectures from a long distance. Manitoga is divided into two individual buildings, Dragon Rock Studio and Dragon Rock House. We will look around the Dragon Rock Studio first. Above all, he usually worked and stayed in this place. The furniture, such as the Lady Susan Cup table and relaxed chair he used, are also exhibited in this studio. The architecture was almost embedded into the ground, so it was a new perspective from the indoors to the outdoors. Now we are heading to the Dragon Rock House. The rock house is literally built on the rocks. Most of the materials used for the architecture are exposed indoors. And all the sides of the buildings are composed of glass windows. We can enjoy more sunlight and surroundings from this architecture compared to the studio we just saw before. The interesting part of this space is the kitchen. Different from other kitchen areas, this kitchen is located downstairs under the gigantic rock stairs. As he is famous for utensils, 
We can assume he cared for the kitchen as an independent space. His signature utensils are also displayed on the dining table. I hope you guys enjoy this Manitoga tour today. Thank you for watching my video.